one second. Okay, so we're back with more of the of my Pokemon Hawk Gold Nuzlocke. Last time we got the we took down Bugsby, the he she bug gym leader, as well as saved all the slow pokes. To on this episode, on this part, our plan is to get through get get through Goldenrod City, fix the problems with the radio tower, and take down Whitney. Also, maybe do a little bit of level grinding as well. That is definitely will definitely be necessary. Make sure our Pokemon aren't too weak. And that they'll be the ones that'll come out on top. Hold on, I have to make sure everything's working properly first. I think it is. Okay, let's go. Got to go to Alex Ford. Some unfortunate things that happened on the last part is we lost. We had to sack off our Calm Nature Togepi to uh, our gym leader, our rival Cloud, whose name is Cloud. It's a Krokana because we were under leveled and it just had to be done. We also in slow poke as well we ran into a slow poke but it was our second encounter so we weren't allowed to catch it which we which I was very upset and angry about. Hopefully We'll be able to catch all the things you want here. And nothing like that. I think the main focus is I want a uh, Geodude to be a very, to probably be my highest level. But I'd be my highest level's Mon, because I want, I would like, it'll be the main combatant against uh, Whitney as it resists the normal attacks of both her Clefairy and her and her uh, Meltank as well as resists the, the signature rollout of her Meltank. Oh, we need a, okay. The Elix Forest Shrine is attributed to Forest Protector. This is, uh, I remember this is for a special event where this area you can catch the Celebi. Yeah, okay, let's make our way up north. <sighs> Trainer tips. It looks for it's so overgrown with trees that you can't see the sky. Please watch out for audience who may have been trying. Actually, it's probably not safe having this guy out in front. But we'll do it for now because we have one for him, which is a good switch in all grass types and bug types as well. Let's see what we have to be very cautious of all of our opponents, no matter how weak. Because this is a Nuzlocke, and if we lose something, it's gone forever. Bible thump. That was a misplay. Because even though... We don't want to waste any of our... Uh, PP on rock throw and magnitude anything should kill the Caterpie even though it resists. Because Neo Jeff is super strong and Caterpie is very weak. There's no reason, this is a Nuzlocke, so there's no real reason. The Lord Jeff, Jew, um, self destruct. <sighs> Wait. You know? Rock Tomb is ass. Wait. No, I have to. Yeah, all our moves are necessary. Like if we're about, I was thinking maybe if in the last, uh, in a, if we have, if we're out of options, man, 
In the last hurrah, we could do a self-destruct to save our ass from losing this nose off completely, but the moves we have are all pretty useful, so. And I do not actually plan. I don't think we'll be put in that sort of situation at all. We should be fine to adventure onward without boring. Our Neo Jeff, our Geodude, evolves at level 25, so that'll be seven more levels. Let's see what she has to say. Because we care very much about all of the NPC. So what they have to say, come on a girl, come on, but lost and all alone. Poor girl lost in the dark. Elix Ferris. What, you remember me from Fire City? You must be imagining. No, I remember you. Yeah, I definitely saw you before. Anyway, were you showing me how to get out? Yes. You will, aren't you lost? Sort of, no. I'm just trying to progress further. I'm not lost. I know exactly where I'm going. How do you know how to get out of here? I played this game before in the past. I played Pokemon Heart Gold. I played Pokemon Heart Gold and Gold. See, uh, I've watched Let's Plays of this game, like Chugga Conro and. Well, of the second gen games. I watch. And Slow Flake as well. Question. I know a lot about this game. There's no way I'll get lost, even though I haven't played this game for like seven years or seen anyone play through this game for like seven years, so there's still a possibility of that, but you know, whatever. It's a Caterpie. Oh my god, it's a Caterpie. Let's do magnitude again because that should be able to kill it because it has as i explained before caterpie sucks and neo jeff is strong that's pretty much the gist of it so oh my god we're about to be at the most like the best city in all of pokemon the most Prestigious. You all see soon. I love this place more than anything. Oh, honey, you're making Pokédex? Don't call me honey, man. Actually, man, please call me honey. You must ban all kinds of Pokémon. Well, quite a few. Try using you. This TM is Taunt. Ah, it's Taunt. Use entire Pokémon. They only use moves that do damage to your Pokémon. This taunt, taunt's a good move, but I don't know how good it is. It's good in a the competitive, it's good in both the doubles and singles, competitive mega games, smogans, and VGCs, and all kinds of mega games. So then it forces their opponent to attack. It's really good because <sighs> against uh, what cat, many casual players uh, believe, Non-attacking moves are, a lot of them are very, very good, like setup moves, um, status condition moves, all of that. Hazards, they're all very, very good. Uh, there's no reason to learn any, teach any of them taunt right now. Butterfree, what's he have to say? Butterfree! Did you see the shrine that pays homage to the protector? Protector, watch over the forest room on cross time. I think that must be grass. It was. That is the shrine of the legendary Pokemon that goes by the name of Celebi. Let's put Pekko at the front. Wait, I have to close a page here. Something was bothering me. I was getting alerts. Okay, we're able to catch Pokemon here because this is a new route. Let's see what we get. We're not doing dupes claws or anything, so it's like Abra! Oh shit, man. This is good. 
Well, we have no option but to throw our best ball. Got the well, Abra has a high base speed, so I think the fastball would be the best option here. So, since it's going to teleport, uh, this is what we're going to have to do. Will we catch it? Will we not? Who knows? Let's just pray to our Jesus that we catch this thing. I'd love a Abra. Please! Fudge! Well, that sucks. Well, that is awful. Who cares, man? We don't need him anyways. Abra is really low base defense, physical base defense, so we'll probably get killed. Even though its special attack and speed are very high, it's <sighs> whatever, man. It actually sucks hard. Nice to Golden Rod City. The radio tower at Golden Rod is giving away radio cars. After these questions, receive a radio car. I love one. Let's put our Geodude back up front because we want to make it over a level monster. This is where I do my training. Wow, man. You do your training here? I guess it's a good spot, man. Yes, it is. Even though the average just teleport before it can catch. Or you can just kill him and get any experience, but whatever. I guess it's a good magnitude should be able to kill it. I like to think. I think I need to get my bell sprout up as well. Yeah, I need to get my bell sprout up as well because it's my only. It's good against a. Uh, it's because I have two water type weaknesses and I have, and my rival has a crop in them. So I have to make sure it's not under a level because it has to carry me against my rival as well. And I just don't want it to suck, man. Because it's stump, man. It stumps the freaking legend. I love stump. Dun 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 dun. Page. Send in Neil Jeff again. This is an easy counter to flying types. Easy, man. Do rock throw once again. <sighs> and we miss once again. Plus, that 0.9 accuracy coming through. That 0 0.9 Captain Zack versus Comer carry accuracy, man. Angry. <laughs> that. Where? Well, okay, another Sparrow. Neo Jeff, perfect for this opportunity. Again, easy. This trainer is easy, man. Nothing for it. Not even a challenge. Am I saying? Did I set up my stream correctly? I think so. What's his name? Shit. If you fall, I messed his name. I'm so sorry, this guy. If you fell in practice, then you had to try harder. It made me to be a gym leader. You're right, man. If you fail, just keep trying again and again. But it can be hard if even if you keep trying, you fail over and over, no matter what you think you do. But if that happens, you just need to change the way. You need to change up something. You need to review yourself. Ask people for advice. Ask people what you can do. Talk to other people. They'll help you. People are open to help you, man. You don't have to do these things on your own. I just got my Pokemon from Dakia. There's a vice. Even though this, you can help yourself too. Look out. Everything's on the internet if you need help. Just guides, YouTube videos, whatever. For anything. I just got my Pokemon from Dakia. Let's see how much stronger I got. 
Well, I don't know, man. You look pretty old. I don't know if you walked enough through steps for your Pokemon to raise. Get all that SIG XP Poke fan branded. Snowball. In this game, fourth gen, he's still a uh, still normal type. Later in the sixth gen, he Snowball gains a fairy type. But he still got that intimidate on to us. But let's see how much uh, magnitude does to it anyways. Through that intimidate, which is well, we're still super strong, man. Yo, Jeff's super strong. It doesn't matter if you scare it, man. It's not gonna do stack. Well, our uh, our bell sprout, our stump resists the uh, Mary, so we're gonna send him in here. Easy for easy, easy. That sig XP, man. That's all we need here. I'm gonna just check that my stream's working properly because I haven't done that yet. It should be because I've done several streams. But I just have to make sure nothing's, everything's how I want it to be. Make sure nothing's. Okay, it's working. Okay. Why does it end this way? Because her Mareep sucks and I have all the counters. I have Stump and Neo Jeff and all that. Even my one for him and my Pekko can destroy it, man. Your are actually not my Pekko. My Pokemon new moves. I didn't know I had. That confronted me to know it. That is true. In the daycare, uh, when a Pokemon learns a move, they alert it no matter what. It will erase one of the moves you had. It will even... Yeah, that's what it does. And it makes me super angry, especially when it like erases egg moves. But it's okay because there's a move reminder guy. So, it's nothing to shit yourself over. I'm the best in my class. Just because you're the best in your class doesn't mean you're good, man. Like, I'm sure I'm the best at Pokemon in all of my classes I've ever taken. But you know what? I actually, I am very good at Pokemon because I am a Pokemon master. And I, I have more experience than just that. Okay, make you scary. So, we have our, we have two, uh, actually just one fighting resist. See Stump. This is why Stump needs to be a higher level. We have to watch out for his other moves. Especially the Slayer scares me to death. Fine will probably carry out speed. That's good. I know Makes are pretty fast. Okay. We should go first and this has no chance of missing. So now that will be the end of this main key man. Even though make uh, makes me kind of a little bit sad because Makey's one of my favorite fighting types. It was like the first fighting type I've ever used on any of my Pokemon teams. Pokemon Red because it's found in one of the first routes, even though it's pretty rare. Well, our ground type counter is also Diglett, um, Stomp. Actually, no, it doesn't resist ground, but the head. But uh, grass type moves are super effective against ground types, so I should be able to kill it in one hit. So that's what I wanted to do there. Our stump will evolve in five more levels, and uh, and our uh, Geo do evolve in. Uh, Around the same amount of levels. My level 25. Um, the the regular the okay, the paralyzed condition is a uh, much better than the regular poison condition because it lowers their speed to 1.5 1.4 times in this game. They changed it to 1. Point, to 
to half the your half the Pokemon speed in the later Gen Gen 7. In this game, it decreases it to just one quarter of the speed. While the rec regular poison status does like one sixteenth damage per turn, I know it might be one eight. No, burn does one eight. And then, but toxic, toxic's a much better decision because the condition because it uh, increases the uh, damage per turn. But here, yeah. Oh, if you transfer into my class, I become the second best student in my class. Why not? Yeah, because like, I'm better than you, man. That's how it works. I want to get stronger. Or if that could happen. So would you trade phone numbers with me? Then we can have Pokemon battles together. Of course I'll do that with you, man. Easy. Extra phone number in the book. Cool, I'll give you a call when I'm ready to battle again. You can call me too. I'll call you. Actually, I don't know. I really don't call people very often, but I should try to remember. I'm trying hard so I can be the star in my class. Man, just never give up. If you just keep trying and actually keep trying and never give up, you'll become on top. You'll surpass even me. Lyra, oh my god, it's Lyra. That's my girl, that girl from that I saw in the beginning of this game. Oh my gosh, for like soulmates, man. Why we keep running into her? Oh my gosh. Oh, I got the chills. Wow. And that Meryl too. And then she's talking to our grandpa, man. We already know me and her family, man. That means we're meant to be. Lyra, good work, grandpa. The Pokemon Rage Ring has been as healthy as can be. You look fit too. Oh, so then. So he gave her that mural? Or did he get new Pokemon? Hi, Bryce. Oh my god, she said hi to me before. So let me introduce you to this Bryce, this trainer. He seems to be getting better at raising Pokemon. Nah, man. I was already perfect. The perfect Pokemon trainer, man. I know all there is. Well, not as good as you could. What, man? You don't know that. I'm stronger than your, even your grandpa, even though it might be. You just think he's more knowledgeable than me, than me because he's older and been around Pokemon for much longer. I'm like 12, but IRL, I'm much older than 12, 22, and I have pretty much as much experience of Pokemon you can possibly have. I played since the very first game, Pokemon Red. <sighs> Actually, Pokemon Green was at least first, but the very first, you know what I mean. Series of games: Pokemon Red, Green, Blue, Blue, Green, Yellow, Red, Blue, Yellow, Green. Yeah. Their grandma. Oh, the daycare center's by the, her grandparents. Look, just my friend is surprised. Oh, this is her boyfriend. Yeah, yeah, I am. I see, huh? Oh my God! Why did you just call him my boyfriend? What the hell? He says my friend. <laughs> That's what she said. Well, Grandma, what are you talking about? He just happens to live nearby, and we're soulmates, and we keep running into each other. And he chose a Cyndaquil just so he could lose in me and Sam back. And so, so uh, I would still like him and not hate him for destroying me. He just happens to live nearby. <laughs> I know, I know. Since you're running here, Larry, you must be sure about his talent. Right, Paris? Come and see us soon. Anytime. Sometime. Well, I better go now. See ya. See ya later, Lyra. Here. Oh, I almost forgot. Here's... This is my Poke... Oh my god, I just got a girl's phone number. That's not just that Liz girl. This is my friend, man. Oh, Paris, I just should... Lyra in the Poke game. Wow, that's two, man. We got two girls' numbers now, man. Actually, three, because we got our moms as well. Let's go. You know you should talk to your Pokemon as they follow you. They do all sorts of cute stuff on the roads and in towns. I'm taking notes every time they do funny things. Give me a call, and I'll share some. They definitely do do some weird things, man. Pokemon are weird. Almost as weird as me. No, that's not possible. Call me. I'm calling out your son. Okay, man. Show me all the info. All the news. Don't you say anything. We are both trainers. We are supposed to exchange numbers. Are we? Ah, nah. That's not. I know the true reason why, man, we exchange numbers. I'll call you. Every moment I get, man. That's all. 
Oh yeah, she called me right away, man. She cannot resist me. Hello, this is Slayer. How are you? Hey, you know there's so much tall grass on Route 46. Is there? Make sure to catch Pokemon there. What the Pokemon you have with the also become worried about when a wild Pokemon come leaping out. One second. She thinks she didn't know about that, what Pokemon, the po the grass movie, man. We know all about that. But thanks for, let's call her again, man. We're gonna call this girl as much as we possibly can. Lyra, childhood friend. Oh man, that, 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 that means, you know what that means, man. Oh, Bryce, how are you? That means we're in there. You know, Farfetch are known to have a strange fascination with you at first when they're there. It's like they don't even hear you. I think I might make a Farfetch, take a Farfetch to see for myself. And I should try that too. Too bad we don't have one. Well, let's call this other girl in our contest. Hi, Snickle Turf. How you doing? I'm calling all these girls in my all all these girls that's in my Pokey Gear, man. I I just got my childhood friend's phone number. And I have this little girl picnicker's phone number as well. Listen, listen, my new is so pretty. Giggle, so awesome. Yes, but much. Lovely, just ravishing. Oh, too much hug at sleep. That's right. So, so nice. I love you. You know, clean. Yo, hi. Yeah, we're done with that, though. This is her, our childhood friend's grandma, man. We just got to the daycare in uh, Goldenrod City. The teacher. The daycare is one of my favorite things in Pokemon. Where I spend most of my time uh, breeding my Pokemon to get all the sick eggs, with all the sick Eevees, natures, and all that. I get to do a lot of that for competitive Pokemon, which I used to do. I'm gonna quit Smash Bros just to play Pokemon again. VGC, the skinny. And, uh. anyway, I'll show you my team's names real quick. I don't, uh, we have on our team Neo Jeff, which is a play on uh, the word it has Neo Geo, and it has a uh, uh, has a uh, Jeff, which is the name of Dwayne's Geo dude. We have Stump, which is a Pokey Pokemon personality. He he's on a uh, Alex Aglosa streams, which is a top VGC player used to be. And, but I like this guy more, he's from Oregon as well. We have Pekko, which is named off from the guy, one of the pro tags in the ping pong animation. And it's like Peck. And he has a quirky nature. This stump has a careful nature. It's plus special defense minus uh, special attack, which is good because Victory Bell special at physical attack is actually much higher and it learns Leaf Blade. Adamant nature is perfect for Geodude, because I already attacked my mine is special attack. We have the legendary. You know, this needs no explanation at all. One for him. I used to pronounce it 14 him, but I asked Shinko to name one of his Pokemon, one for her, and he pronounced he did the correct pronunciation, so now I know. I know now. Hasten. And we we have Lucy, which is named after my uh, aunt. Rat, uh, my aunt who hates rats and it's like gets is like really really freaking scared of rats like insanely so that's like the thing she hates and then Batwoman because <laughs> I don't know oh I didn't know because all the good names were taken like someone already named one after Bandarian and Bearbot named him after himself so we got all that we could let's see if there's I don't know if there's anything left Certain rats, yeah. They're rare, but some some can be in cool. They're disgusting, but they're cool. We have two Pidgeys. Let's see, they're both minus B nature. And our Togepi and Qbert died because we ran into our rival earlier than it. Ex I, than I remembered, and we weren't exactly ready, so we had to sack them off. And he can't evolve for a while in this game, so. It was the only choice. We'll put 
We'll put our Connor in the daycare. Cause that's the one JoJo name. We'll do that. Actually, we'll put them both in the daycare. I think you you can put should be able to put two. Okay. Thank you for tuning in in the first place, man. I hope you come back. Just do focus on your homework for now. Thanks. I'll, I'll enjoy. I have the best game I can. Oh my god, my things. The legendary Stickledorf joined my stream, but now he's gone. He's the <coughs> Mewtwo Slayer. <coughs> he got that Sig first stock off of Rich Brown, and he also got defeated the legendary. <coughs> he doesn't want me to say his name. He doesn't. E Sam. Okay, we're gonna store both of our Pidgeys in here. Actually, no. We'll do our Zubat instead of one of the Pidgeys. Scruffy, my road. We're wasting our money. Zubat in the daycare. Let's see. I need to check something real fast. Okay. Let's... Okay, let's put our Zubat in the daycare real fast. Let's freaking go. We got that Gary follow. Thanks for the follow, Sinkletor. Now let's put Batwoman in daycare, man. We're not good enough to train a full-grown woman. Bat, man. We can't. Our training isn't good enough, man. We need ex experience in individuals. Like our childhood friend's grandparents to train him, her. We're not up to the task at all. I have an idea, I'll give you our numbers. Then you can check on the Pokemon race for you. Actually, thank you very much. I'd love to. I'm gonna have to go back here to pick up my Pidgey and my Zubat. Send your race Pokemon. I'll be happy to have use for this Pokegear, my grandchild game. I love your grandchild, man. She's I love her. Pokemon daycare, let's raise her Pokemon. Of course you I would, man. As long as you don't kill it. I'm on patrol for suspicious individuals. You think I'm suspicious? I don't think so. Let's go. Who's this? I'm confident my ability to raise Pokemon. Want to see? Yeah? I can't see your confidence, man. Confidence isn't something you can see. Actually, you can see through her how she they play. Of course. Oh, I see now, man. You have a side up. There's no reason not to be confident when you have a side up. Side ups are something else. Let's go. Stomp. Side up's my second favorite water type after Slowbro. It was originally my favorite. But I like. I just like Slowbro slightly more. Even though Psy Psyduck actually is my profile picture for now for for this for my Twitch. Oh man, it's, oh, that Psyduck's holding on. Oh, fuck. he disabled our only attacking move. What will we do? 
will go into our Pico. Pidgey. Pico or Pidgey. Okay, Scr scratch. Okay, uh, we have cook attack, so we'll just kill it off real fast. Let's go. Our Pidgey will evolve soon, too. We'll probably want to get it to level 18. We have three Pokemon that will evolve really soon, actually. I think we'll see before we get to Whitney. We'll have it all planned out. We should both train our Pokemon some more and have another battle, so we should really shoot one the Twitch. Yes! Uh, another girl's number. Man, we have three! Four! We have four females in our phone, man. Okay, see you later. Well, maybe thinking to Pokemon. Yeah, Pokemon Daycare is good too for training, but the only problem is they don't won't gain any of those sig effort value points, EVs. If you want an explanation of EVs, just ask me. I won't do that right now because it's kind of, kind of a challenge. Okay, our just actually fast. It's not it's not fast, it's just a lot higher level than drowsy. And drowsy is not particularly fast. So it outspeed. And it's bait. Okay, 15 speed, so 45 attack, 44 defense, 47 8. This is standard. It's mostly focus on the attack and defense, which are Judy's highest. Embargo is not really a good move. Let's see what it does. I know what it does, but like, I just need to... It's bad. It, prevents the, see, it just prevents the flow from using the tail on it. The trainer is also... It just prevents... Items are really good, but like... I don't know. There's so much better moves that you can usually use in one of your four slots in Embargo. Here we are. We're at Golden Run City. Okay, hold on. We're listening to that music again. I'll get my explanation. Let's fill up our Pokemon really fast. Gotta take your Pokemon for a few seconds. Let's see how many seconds. One, two, three. That's like five seconds. Seven. Now, thank you for waiting. We serve Pokemon. I didn't have to wait much, man. It was just a few seconds. Hey. Hey, here. I'll take your Pokemon for a second. Oh, here's a Pokemon back. Thanks for waiting. Let's do Constant series for Link Battles. Battle record. Record such as how many times you Link Battles. I'm sorry. I know all about that, man. Thanks, Bo. Since this is... Just, you know, it's a... We won't be able to do any Link Battles here on this particular game. It's just unfortunate because they're like my favorite thing now in a po the in Pokemon since the first gen, and it's where I when I spend more of my time uh, tra either training for or I'm participating in when I play Pokemon games nowadays. How many kinds of Pokemon there are in the world? A long, there's a bunch, man. Probably more than we know because I keep creating new ones that we don't know about, man. Thank you. Long time ago, Prince Oak said there, there's actually an infinite amount. It's all in her head, man. If you have any ideas for a Pokemon, they can become real. There are 450 different. Since then, many new Pokemon have discovered in different regions. Almost 500 different kinds known now. A higher level of Pokemon doesn't always win. After all, it may have a type disadvantage. And I think there's so. Pokemon that is true. There's. Except for Arceus, it's the best. It can, have, it can be any type, man. And it has like the best stats. But there are many, 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 many strong Pokemon. The radio town going around the city is a landmark. They're really running a promotional campaign right now. Go modify Pokemon here so I can also serve it. We're gonna have to do that in a bit. Hold on. It's getting kind of hot. I'll take off my sweatshirt. Mm. 
Okay, let's talk here. Now let's go check this place out real fast. Welcome to the Golden Round, the department store. This one of the most signature department store. This is the second one. The one is Celadon City in Kanto region. And this are the two most memorable department stores for me. Department store is a decent selection, but some items are only available as King Cook. Game corner. There's the elevator over there, but it's taking the stairs. Mom's good at bargain hunting. She always buys stuff at lower. Of course, she knows all about that because the mothers are the ones that know all about shopping, man, stores. And not wasting money, man. They should be the best with their money, but I don't know. That's not really true. I'm wearing the shop again today. You always are, man. Bet you always are. <sighs> Wait, let's call all the girls in our poke. We got, oh, we even got, actually that's five now. We got the daycare lady, man. Actually, that Todd was a guy, man. We were fooled, like someone thought that was a girl. Let's see, I think it'll tell us, the lady will tell us how many levels our Pokemon will raise. Connor's going by five with bat wounds. And this, the daycare man will tell you if he has a, has an ache for Pokemon got it on, man. That's what he knows all about. Hell, it's you. The daycare lady somehow. I'm sure. Your Pokemon and Batman doing just fine. The two don't seem to like each other much. Just, uh... Wait, that means they can have an ache, I think. I think. I'm not sure they're in the same good root ache group or not, but it seems like they are. Our main focus would probably be raw. Super potions are our main focus. We can't use revise, nothing will faint. Antidotes we got. Five of those already. Hold on. Got all this. We have plenty of all these status preventing things. But full hills are good. Actually, we have plenty of the other ones, so we won't need that. Hyper potions heal too much for this early in the game. Might need a couple more potions, yeah. A few more would be good. Or we don't want to heal the max 50. <laughs> I don't think we have anything that we really want to sell as of now. Walker, what do you need? I need to buy Pokeballs. You know, we probably... I'll get a great ball. We need more up to... We need to make sure to catch our Pokemon not that, that they don't escape like our freaking Abra that escaped that made me super upset. Can't believe that Abra escaped. I'm so mad. We had a fastball and everything from Kurt. Uh. It was so close. It appeared to be caught on my Abra at the game corner. That's my best partner. Doesn't It's good to hear. Abra is cool. I wish I had one. Yeah, they're rubbing in my face. I was complaining that I didn't catch my Abra. I got an Abra in the game corner. Ugh. The existence of apartment store tells me that Golden Brown is a big city. The selection here is unmatching walls. Yeah, man. You know, you can have just a department store. It doesn't have to be a big city. You're having a department store in the middle of no, in like a small city. 